Yo, what's poppin' everybody? Welcome back to another community card review. My name is Smeljo, and thank you for watching. Now let's get started. We are gonna be reviewing a card called Diamond Dust. Diamond Dust is an ice spell, two pip ice spell that does 25% damage and 6% pierce to all ice spells. This is a bubble. Um, yeah, right off the back, I could say that this card would probably only be used in a PvP situation. Um, and I know for a fact that in PvP situations, people do bubble world wars and they fight for control over the bubble. So this would probably you be used in certain situations like that. Currently, Ice already has a bubble spell and it's called Belfrost. Belfrost is a two pip bubble spell that does plus 35% damage. So if we compare the two, Belfrost does 10% more damage than this one. But I do believe that the pierce, the 6% pierce is, uh, it's more beneficial than 10% more damage. So essentially all this would do do is replace the uh, the Belfrost spell and more people would probably only use Diamond Dust versus Belfrost. And that's not what we want to do. We don't want to make a card that's going to replace another card. What we want to do is make a card that will be used at the same rate as another other card. So with that being said, I think personally I would change the pips of this card probably to three pips or I would probably decrease the amount of peers to 3% peers maybe. Or maybe decrease the damage or something like that. But yeah, I do think it's a good card. I don't PvP at all, and I know this is primarily a PvP card. But um, just from... I, I like the fact that they use the combination of damage and pierce. I think that is cool. And uh, yeah, that's what makes me like the card pretty much. And I also like the name. It's kind of like, like diamond dust. And you think of diamonds, and diamonds are what? Like sharp. And you think dust, like something that's, you know, like small and flying, you know, small flying and very sharp, you know, pierce, you know? I don't know. I like what they did there. I like what they did there. All right, let's read some comments down below. Um, Reddit said, maybe reduce the damage to like 10 to 15%, and I think it's a great idea. Otherwise, everyone will stop using Belfrost. I completely agree. I do think everyone will stop using Belfrost if this card were to come out, and I think reducing the damage to two, 10 to 15% is a good idea, Um, or you could just raise the amount of pips, and you could probably get the same outcome. Another person said, if this is a bubble, I think it's all right. It's kind of like a fusion between Katabotic Wind and Belfrost. Of course, I'd probably never use it in PvE, but it seems all right. I completely agree. Um, I I would probably not use this in a PvE situation. I think I'd rather just use my regular bubble. Um, and even in PvE situations, you don't really bubble because it's not that necessary. Um, but yeah, I probably wouldn't use this in PvE, mainly for the flex if it does look really cool, like the animations or whatnot. Other than that, I probably just wouldn't use it. But yeah, it's uh, it's a it's a good card in my opinion. I think it's a pretty solid card. Um, whoever made it, you did a really good job. Let me know what you guys think down below in the comments. Thank you for watching. If you have any concept cards that you would like me to review, uh, just leave me a link down in the comments. I'll check them out. I'll give you a shout out if I do review it. And yeah, I appreciate you guys for watching. Have a great day. My name is Smojo. I'll see you on the next one. And peace.